Hey, what's up everyone, so welcome back to another video. So a few months ago, I showed you a comparison between Microsoft Edge Chromium with Google Chrome. And today I'm gonna put them both to the test because Microsoft Edge back then was in a beta version or wasn't even beta, was like a preview version. And right now it's the official released version and we got them put them both to the test. Of course, we could add more browsers to this test, but it will take much longer uh, so I don't want this video to be very, 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 very long. I'm not going to show you the differences between these two browsers because on the previous video was kind of to show you those differences. In this video, let's see just the performance between these two. I have here at the bottom my Microsoft Edge Beta, which I have a tab opened because I need to copy some uh, websites. This here at the bottom is the Microsoft Edge official and then Google Chrome. Of course, if I open here at the top, then it opens this one at the bottom. And let's open Google Chrome as well. I put on Google Chrome as well a picture just so they are more or less uh, the same. Now, firstly, if we're gonna open the task manager, we see here this Microsoft Edge uh, 9 is my Microsoft Edge beta. I have here a website opened. This is the Microsoft Edge normal. If I'm gonna go, let's put it here. If I'm gonna go and open YouTube, then you will see here it increases in memory usage and as well CPU. But yeah, Google Chrome, it's not using anything and uh, it's already using some CPU. I don't know about that, but now it's, it's look, it's, it's going to 2%, 3%. I don't know about that, but it's not using anything. But this is just a small tip. Let's go into testing these two browsers. First, I'm gonna go first is this Sun Spider script, which is gonna take very fast, but I have other scripts which will take a bit longer. So, so I'm gonna start first on the Microsoft Edge and then use it on Google Chrome. So I have these tests separately. So in this case, actually Google Chrome wins a little bit this is Google Chrome, you see here on the right side as well, 176.6 milliseconds and then Microsoft Edge 179. Of course, we can run the test a second time to see if there's gonna be any difference, but uh, well, on the first test, Google Chrome won. And then we have a second test, well, it's a little less than the previous one, the previous one was 179 milliseconds now it's 177 still google chrome wins this test going into the second one let's go into this script and let's start the test this will take a little longer okay it's completed let's go as well into chrome start up 10.0 So here we have the result, again, Google Chrome wins this battle by 200 points. Not much, but well, win is a win. Begin. Here we have the result. And here we have the result. Well, <laughs> Microsoft Edge wins this one just by very little bit just by 0 0.2 milliseconds well this is almost nothing but well win is a win going into the fourth one let's start this test as well Okay, let's go into Google Chrome as well. Let's copy the link. Thank you. 
Ooh, and here we have a winner as well. Not by much, but Microsoft Edge wins this test. So I guess we are to a 2 2. There we have it. Let's go to Google Chrome. What a difference, damn, I wasn't expecting this one. What happened? The, 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 <laughs> the difference is pretty big, start test. Oh, there we have another winner for Microsoft Wedge, even though this is very, very close, but win is a win. Going into the next one, yeah, well, I want to go, let's start it. Ooh, what a big difference. Well, in this one, Google Chrome just wins it. Big win for Google Chrome. Let's go into the last test to see which one will win it and start. Thank you. 
And here we have the last win of this test. Microsoft Edge wins it again. Not by much in this last test, but still win is a win. You see here in the photo enhancement, uh, actually Google Chrome has more points than Microsoft Edge and even Organize Albums has more points. The video did take quite a lot of time to make it. Please leave a like if you found this video useful. I hope you enjoyed the video and I see you in the next one.